It's now time for Ask the Vet, brought to you by Brasses Valley Equine Hospital, dedicated professionals committed to helping each horse reach its full athletic potential. Crystal from Lubbock, Texas asked how to determine if her horse has EPM, or equine protozoal myeloencephalitis. EPM is a neurologic condition of horses caused by parasites that migrate through the nerves, the spinal cord, and the brain. EPM affects horses of all ages, although most horses are younger than five years of age. It is diagnosed in one out of four neurologic horses. Clinical signs of EPM are widely variable and can range from a mild gait abnormality to severe incoordination, loss of balance, or changes in muscling and mentation. Diagnosis is made by a veterinarian who will first perform a full gait and neurologic evaluation of your horse taking into account his behavior, ability to interact with his environment, symmetry of facial features and muscling, and the way your horse moves. Once a horse is determined to have neurologic deficits, the most commonly performed diagnostic tests include radiographs of the neck and blood tests for viral causes, such as West Nile virus. Diagnosis of EPM is complicated, as many horses that are exposed to the parasite do not become neurologic, but will test positive. Therefore, there are specific tests performed on blood or cerebrospinal fluid submitted by your veterinarian to determine the likelihood that your horse has EPM. There are a number of different treatments for EPM. However, most require a 28-day course of oral medications. Thank you for your question, Crystal, and please visit our website at bveh.com for further information. Ask the Vet, brought to you by... Brasses Valley Equine Hospital, now with three convenient locations in Texas, Navasota, Rockdale, and Stephenville.